cut up randos. Are we all doing this fine evening? So, who fancies coming to a bit of a rave with me? Yeah, yeah. Calm down, kill your bananas. A rave in the form of a poem. Now, this poem is featured in Polyfox Paranormal's latest video, The Spirits of the Antwerp Mansion Part 2. And this poem will be located at 2 minutes 52 seconds. And she filmed it and included it for people to pause the video and have a read if uh, they were curious or interested, I suppose. Um, me doing that, being to take them with the venue. Um, once I'd read this poem, I couldn't not do a reading of it and feature it on my channel. Um, because it plucked a few chords with me uh, and my memories. I'm back in the day. So, uh, yeah. I do recommend, though, that you still go over to Polyfox Paranormal. Subscribe if you haven't already. Seek out the video, The Spirits of the Antwerp Mansion Part 2. I'd also seriously recommend you watch Part 1. Um, scroll up to 2 minutes 52 seconds, pause it and read it for yourself. Because with poetry, especially, we all have our own minds, our own imagination and our own senses of perception. So each poem will affect each person that reads it in a different way. And you will imagine it in a different way. Probably to how I see it. But make of it what you will. So here goes nothing. It's called An Ode to Antwerp Mansion and it is written by Sean Stapleton. <coughs> the road to Antwerp is an irregular one. Slurping down mouthfuls of terrible rum. Snorting a leveller revelers come through a land of kebabs luminescence of sun swing a quick left with the peasant you've brung and fight through the queue it's a hell of a scrum david's a donut i'm telling you son i'm trying to pick up but he's belling his mum too close on his phone compellingly dumb i'm after some pills is she selling me some he brushes it off, repelling her tongue with the arrogant charm of rebellious fun. Infamous doorman, challenge accepted. Jaws are clenched tightly and baggies are arrested. In ill-fated crevices, gladly ingested. So you'll only get caught if you're badly molested. Antwerp is marmite, it chops down the middle. Not for the far right, cops or the civil. But if you like dark nights and shopping at little, then look for your mark nights and drop in at skiddle. Cause it's probably for you if you don't mind it grimy, pressing down every night, threads getting slimy. It can't be avoided soaking in sweat. So it's more odd the toilet than oh the toilet. Gothic musings establish the vibe, scrawled on the wall as you scramble inside. Haunted house happenings danger persists as you enter the mansion at your own risk. Littered with booby traps, home along five, boys craving scooby snacks roaming outside. The zone is alive with the sound of the sub, where the techno will grime all the fairest of dub. Bass is the currency, organs will wobble, teeth will be rattled and dormant will squabble. A ramshackle ethos with speakers stacked high as sound travels up through your sneakers and thighs. Everyone's grooving, having a laugh and consuming their bombs like that gag in the mask. It's not long till all the bedraggling starts, the Audrey Hepburn staggering past. Now grabbing their arse, it's not tolerated. Meatheads forbidden and groping is hated. 
girls here are plucky. No fucks are located, so you won't just get burnt, you'll get bloody cremated. You're needing a break from the sweaty enjoyment, so you pike a quick straight and then head for the toilet. Where old or night meets modern unruly, a resident evil stairwell that threw me. Pink carpet vanished as really and truly. I must have smoked one hell of a doobie. We're a drug Neapolitan. There's Jeffrey's galore. The one June hail and the one June endure. Posh kids that sometimes are known to go for. They're stuck in the cubicle, prone on the floor. You show them the door, but it doesn't exist. Humans stand warily, blushing in fits. Acting innocuous, buzzing to bits. But they're blocking a mate who's rushing the shit. The flush is legit, so you head on in after. To a Jackson Pollock inspired disaster. A spectrum explosion, graffiti and plaster. Doors booted off by the feet of the bastards. But kept the fuck up and can't get the fuck out. Unstable urchins infected with doubt. Etiquette's different, reflecting is out. So no side glancing ladies, affecting their coat. You finish your business and memory bounce back to the crew and their regularly pounce. It's heavily housed that sums up the place, a Victorian mansion shot into space. It slowly creeps up that the shindig is over. Not just tonight, but the distant moreover. And the thought alone makes you instantly sober. The first years will have an indifferent October. Because where will they go when all said and done? When they're quite frankly sick of the force fed fun. Of plush, boring venues, gold in the centre. When they can't afford cabs when it's cold in December. And cannot be bothered to dress to impress. And the soul motivation is making a mess of themselves and their outfit when the feeling is fuck it. 256 is alright but it ain't gonna cut it. First we had Sankey's the roadhouse then mantra. Same control when these are moments of stature. When planning departments suppose they can capture the youth of this city by closing the chapter of interesting places where clothing's a factor because the punters aren't suited self-loving contractors inhaling their wrappers in the snow of the back of a VIP lounge of emotionless actors there's no force on earth and no magic potion it tells a young student afraid we're not open and thinks that they'll head off into the night with their spirit subdued unwilling to fight for the right to get crushed beyond all recognition, to rave and to shout and to fuck and to glisten. They thrive on rebellion, martyrdom even, turn the bass up and blast in the ceiling. So watch out for this monster, condone the creation, as the council have sponsored their own aggravation. And that is the entire poem from start to finish, An Ode to Antwerp Mansion by Sean Stapleton. So make of it what you will, and read into it what you will. If you do have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. If you're not subscribed, click the subscribe button, it's free don't cost you a penny if you remember smash the like as well <laughs> not asking too much uh, you're asking the world oh, list of jobs now ah. just joke but yeah if you want to read and experience this for yourself go off to polyfox paranormals channel find the video the spirits of antwerp mansion part two I would recommend you watching part one as well. And uh, two minutes, 52 seconds. It pause. It's there for you.
but it is a bloody long poem but well worth well worth checking out I think right until next time then me randos at oh 4 20 a.m no bullshit <laughs> I bid you good morning good night keep raving randos <laughs>